Oh, I got a fish. Got a nice fish on. Oh, shoot. Shoot. That's a nice one. Absolutely smoked it. That's a beautiful fish. You see that right there? That is my 100,000 subscriber plaque and I wanna add to it. So join everybody who's joined before you by hitting subscribe and turn your notification bell on right now because this channel is all about fishing, family, and the outdoors. My son, Kai, is only nine weeks old, maybe two months, and uh, I already got like three fishing rods for him. Can't wait till he's big enough to have a fishing rod and learn how to catch some fish, go on the boat, start getting him used to being outside, you know? It's gonna be a whole whole adventure, a whole story coming along on this, on this channel. So, like I said, type of content you wanna see, hit subscribe. If you wanna see me do something more specifically, drop a comment. Let me know what you wanna see from the channel, you know? Because uh, pretty much I fish as many days a week as I possibly can. Got the newborn at the house, you know, two month old. So obviously that poses some some issues on uh, time, because when my wife is at work, I gotta kinda help out with the baby and vice versa. So it's a lot of stuff happening. So I hope you guys are in for the ride and uh, like what you're seeing on the channel. You guys wanna be my cameraman, let me know. I need one. Someone, I'll teach you how to do YouTube and social media. So if you wanna learn how to use a DSLR camera, and how to get the different angles and set up the lights and and create the content and storyboard and stuff just let me know i'm looking for oh what was that i'm looking for an apprentice someone who i could teach and maybe build another uh, channel and and grow with you know there's money to be made just got to invest the time so the stories about florida are true the weather is absolutely bipolar down here one moment it could be sunny and bright out and within the weather can change from beach weather to a monsoon with tornado warnings and stuff and that's what happened to me the other day when i was trying to film a video but i was out there casting trying to catch fish for you guys anyways check it out all right guys what better time to fish than during a lightning storm down here in miami florida get this camera set up front view and uh yeah I left my tripod and stuff at home, but sometimes there's fish over here. I'm going to cast out, see if we can cast something. The rain is really coming down now, but I'd like to try and catch a fish. So we're going to sit here in this rain and this lightning and thunder here in Miami, Florida. I'm working some current right in front of me and uh, let's see if we can get a fish. The things I do for the people on my channel, or for my own pride, because it is absolutely coming down right now. Woo! This is nasty. And it's freezing cold. You know it's bad when there's still water pouring off your hat. <sighs> Not been sitting in the car. Woo! Yeah, it's bad out there. It was a little too, too much weather for me. I couldn't keep my gear safe, my camera was getting wet, and I did not want to risk ruining my equipment, so I had to pack it up, and I went out today after I finished filming with Monster Mike, and I decided, you know what, I need to catch some peacock bass, and that's exactly what I did. I went, I was blind casting, got popped, and uh, had a few fish blow up on me, decided to walk the bank and catch some fish. I went, I filmed the episode with Monster Mike, you can go over to the Monster Mike channel, Monster Mike Fishing, and check that out over there. I gotta run across the street so I don't get run over. Look at that, super fast, just like in my young days. And uh, let's see what we can catch over here. It's not as pretty over here. Actually, it's not pretty anywhere over here. There are crocodiles, so I have to be careful not to get too close to the water. Let's go this side. Right here. Yeah. That'd be great if I just got a huge blow up, right? Make sure there's no snakes or crocodiles right here. But I like to cast along this ledge. If I can stay out of the wind, that'd be great. Looking for some wake right behind my lure. 
Come on. Oh, you saw that? Oh. Oh, I'm on. I'm on. Just like I said. Nice. I don't know what it is. It is. Woo. A Mayan cichlid. Get tired, buddy. Get tired, buddy. Woo. That's a pretty one, too. Look at this, guys. Mayan cichlid. On the artificial. Hey, he just rushed right up on that. I was hoping it was something else, but you know, beggars can't be choosers. Am I right? Am I right? But he did chase it. I saw the weight, everything. Hopefully, I. Ooh, another fish. Oh. Oh, something else hit me. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. I was too. I was too busy talking right here. It would have been fun getting them back-to-back -back hookups, but I got some good content so far. Let me walk up here, walk up here, and uh, I'm gonna cast from a little further down, a little further down, Ugh. like right here. Crocodile check, no crocs. There is a little spot right up. Oh, not no. Okay. Oh, I just spooked something. Oh, I'm on. I'm on. I'm on. Oh, this one's stronger. This is stronger. Oh, it spit me. What the hell? I'm crushed. That had to be a snook. That's How you doing, man? You're the CEO. Yeah. Nice to meet you, bro. Likewise. What's Oh, I just missed the snook. I was like starting to fall off the rock, so I rolled the rod this way, and as I rolled it, it spit the freaking hook, man. So, it happens. There's like a sign down over here, some rocks. Let's work this over here. Go this way. Ooh, I got a fish. Got a nice fish on. Ooh, shoo. Shoo. That's a nice one. That's a nice one. Oh. Keep tension on. Ah, I hooks it the wrong way. Oof. Come on, baby. Come to daddy. Come to daddy. Come to daddy. Oh, that's a beautiful fish. Let me get down here. I don't... There's a lot of sludge here. Let me see if I can get it up without getting in the sludge. Ugh. Wow, what a freaking catch. What a beautiful fish this is. Whoo, look at this. Look at this fish. Hold him up for this camera now. Doesn't look as big in my hands because I'm a big boy. I'm a big old Asian, but it is a nice catch. Absolutely smoked it. That's a beautiful fish. There's a school of peacock bass right here. A whole school of them. The question is, will I be able to catch one? I need a cameraman and someone to kind of teach to work with. Oh, another one, another one. It's a nice fish, another nice fish. I'll get back to that thought in one second. Let me land this thing. That is another nice peacock bass, guys. These things will 100% give you bass thumb. Look at that, it's another one, another nice fish. Boom, get them in the water. These are hardy, hardy fish. As long as you don't keep them out for an hour, you can handle them, take some pictures, toss them in. If you toss them in, don't slap them in the water. Make sure they go head first so they have a nice little dive. And they'll grow to keep getting bigger and bigger. But what was I talking about? Oh, an apprentice. I need someone to help me film, you know? I do need someone to help me film. You get to go on the boat with me. I'll take you to fishing, you'll get to fish as well. But I need someone 
to while I'm fishing to get B-roll for me and stuff. You know? That's another, oh shoot, that's another fish. I told you there was a school of them here. That one, it hit it right off the bottom. Okay, all right. Oh, spit it, jumped and spit it. Remember guys, CEO Fishing is brought to you by The Real Hooker Bait and Tackle, Miami's premier bait and tackle shop, Nines Optics. See the fish before the fish see you. And in addition to that, these sunglasses have near tech, which actually block out infrared, which is something that the other name brands don't do. And also by Livingston Lures, the lures that actually attract the fish for you. They have EBS technology and they make bait sounds when they hit the water.